What is up everyone, it's me again, and I'm playing Roblox again, and I'm in Morgan's Mine again. And it looks like I can push all those flocks. And I just hope my best friend Paul James will come here. Come on. Oh, oh, there we go. I have to leave the truck. Hello. Hey. Can you please put your cam on? Sorry. And I'm, I'm in the morning to mine again. Yeah. Yeah, and if wondering, I can't push all these trucks. Oh. So now I have to delete them. Yeah. <clears throat> well, is Mega Machines the best thing related to the Bob the Builder reboot? Yeah. Yeah, and that's the only movie of the reboot to be ever made. Yeah. And it ended off with a re and the reboot ended off with a really good episode. Yeah. Which is New Year Spectacular. Yeah. Oh, Thomas is shaking and oh phew. He didn't derail. I don't know why he's shaking and it's really off timing. Yeah. N oh, bother. Oh. Ah, sometimes Roblox lags on my laptop. Yeah, sometimes it does. And I feel like I have to close it. Yeah. And now, yeah, first I'm streaming with you in the daytime this year. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like I'm hugging you. Not hold hands, a hug. Sorry. Oh, I love you. Same here. And, and, and we both love dying. Yeah. Now, have you got any Mickey Mouse Clubhouse DVDs? Well, I do have a few. Why are they? Well, I do have uh, Mickey and Pluto, Pluto to the rescue, but I think that's the final DVD to have the Disney DVD logo in NTSC pitch. Well, what's the rest of the duties that you got? I've also got uh, Mickey's Adventures in Wonderland and Mickey's Treasure Hunt. Are there any bonus episodes of Little Einstein's and My Friends Tigger and Pooh on them? I don't know. Well, do they both have previews? Um, I'm, I might have to check again at some point. So, did you tell your family that, that you can sign into Discord? 
not just yet. <clears throat> I think my favorite Mega Machine, I think, is it's probably um Ace. Yeah. Because you know, you see, he's he's actually Scoop's best friend in the reboot. Yeah. Well, I don't really like Crunch. Yeah. It's all because he's just like... <laughs> or... <laughs> mm -hmm. You see, he's like Terrence from Angry Birds. Yeah. And even Rolly and Dizzy aren't in Mega Machines. Yeah. And plus, they aren't even featured in the reboot that much. No. They're just background characters. Yeah. And even Dizzy is voiced by um, Claire Collette, which she was also Sweetie Belle in My Little Pony. Jonathan? Oh, you're frozen again. Oh! Um, now, Dizzy is voiced by Claire Collette, which she was, um, Sweetie Belle in My Little Pony. Okay. Well, have you seen Friendship is Magic, though? Not yet. Hmm. Now, Jonathan, um, is In the Night Garden your favorite show from Ragdoll? Is it? I can't hear you. Jonathan, I can't hear you. You're muted. Well, hey, next girl. Oh, hi. I Jonathan. Jonathan. Oh. But you, at least you still have me. Yeah, but you came here just in time. So anyways, I've got, um, I've got, I've, I, I nearly forgot to show this. It's a, uh, it's a, it's a homemade blu it's a fan made Blu-ray I've made. You're back, Jonathan. Um, yeah. And, Come on, please. And, um, it's a fan made Blu-ray I made. Okay, but I'm trying to ask Paul Jones something first. Oh, wait, wait, Nick's Girl Movie 2. Yeah. And, right. um, Jonathan. Yeah. Is In the Night Garden your favourite show from Ragdoll? Like I said, it is. Well, not oh, really. I didn't know that. Anyway, so the front spies released by Nick's Grove Entertainment and it's on Blu ray. Yeah. And back. Four stars, brilliant, quite back for awards, and it's a very PG, mild comic threat, violence language, and it's on for eight minutes. Okay, disc. It's a DVD R, but I it, but I will make the labels a Blu-ray. Okay. Um, Jonathan, is the Lion King your favorite yeah. Disney film? Well, it's only the third movie. What? I'm sorry. I thought you liked all three Lion King films. I know. Well. Well, well, I still can't even prefer number three. You do know. Yes, but, but it's based on a reason. Uh, you did know when I told you uh, back in two years ago when, when you were doing another stream with me. Well, I went to Moan and Pumbaa were in a fiesta. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's the reason why. Um, that's the reason why you like it, because of Timon and Pundu uh, being in theatre. That's why they did videos of uh, the, that and with their favourite movies, according to Lee said. Yeah, and also, remember, remember that last bit when Uncle Max comes in? Yeah. Yeah. 
and then and then Simba then Rafiki come in too. Yeah, yeah, and, then, was... and then Mickey Mouse, yeah, and then and then, and then Snow White, was... oh, then Mickey Mouse, then Snow White, and the Seven Dwarfs, and then Aladdin, then Peter Pan, and the Lost Boys, and then and then um uh um, and a and a Dumbo and Donald Duck. And yes, no, it was Goofy. Oh yeah, Goofy. Yeah. And he was like da 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 da, and then whoa, 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 whoa. and then the and then the last boys pile up, and then and then someone was like, "Watch it!" Yeah. <laughs> and, 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 yeah. Yeah, and then Dumbo finds in. And um, yes, yeah, I'm just... Is that all the Disney characters that come in? <laughs> Yeah. yeah, and then and then Snow White was just like, oh, excuse me, and then and then the seven dwarfs was just like, no, oh, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, get out of my way. Yeah, and then and then someone was like, what's this crowd? Yeah, I was laughing when a load of Disney characters came in. So was I. Yeah, and then and he was like, uh, tomorrow and I just can't stand being in the crowds. Then the credits come on. Yeah. And if you know, in the US it was called the Lion King one and a half. Yeah, I noticed it. Yeah, because we all started off with the circle of life in the first movie, and then yeah, and then and then tomorrow we must fast forwarding to the to the bit where Simba grows up. Yeah, I never realized it was named that thing because we had uh, like these half nights and like the movies like two and a half and five, three and a half like that. Yeah, and the ending is a meme though. Yeah, I mean. Oh yeah. I actually, do with the actually fake movies. <clears throat> yeah, and then all Simba was like, he was just like, um, "Hey, you guys are watching the movie." And then Rafiki was like, "Anything is worth downing twice." Then then Mickey Mouse sits down. <laughs> mm-hmm. And then I was like, "Wait, there's no Winnie the Pooh." Yeah. There's no Winnie the Pooh in it because I, I basically based on children's book. Yeah, and and if and if Winnie the Pooh was coming in, he's like, oh, I think he might be like, hey, do you want some honey? Yeah. Was that the lead scene from the end credits? I don't know. I yeah, and then Tigger would be like, hoo, hoo, hoo. Uh, it's oh. lost. It's lost media, kinda. Yeah. Smith. What's your opinion about me? For me, it's pretty cool. Yeah, probably. I didn't discover it until late 2021. Well, the first thing I discovered on Lost Media was Chris Farley's Shrek. Ooh, okay. Uh, remember the remember the videos of Chris Farley's Shrek? Uh, 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 yeah, that was in production, but then it was cancelled when Chris Farley died from drugs. Ooh, what? Back in 2020, in 2001? No, in 1997. Oh, okay. And then Shrek was originally... Oh, John has gone. And then Shrek was originally going to be voiced by Nicolas Cage as well. In what movie? Um. Well, before the first Shrek came out. And it was... A, and yeah, Steven Spielberg was originally supposed to make an animated Shrek movie by Ambulation, but I was going to star Bill Murray as a Shrek and Steve Martin as the donkey, in case you're wondering. Okay then, but but was it just but did it just decide to make it a DreamWorks film? Yeah, until in, until the until the twenty first century. Okay. Yeah, and I think the last time the last time that BBC One showed it was in twenty the BBC showed the first one was in twenty fifteen. And I believe the for and yeah, Shrek is back. The entire Shrek trilogy is back on Channel Four. Yeah. And I think the first one was actually on ITV from 2019 to 2022. Yeah, that was correct. Anyways, um, Apollo, uh, I mean, some fake gangs now. Oh, bother. 
not not the presenters, not like CBBC or CBBC, just like movies. So Pollux aired on. Uh, um... Jonathan, please come back. So, anyways, fake airings, but without CBBC and CBBC, just movie related American. <laughs> So this yeah. movie I made up myself and Pollux came out on came on channel four and it came to came to ITV on in uh mid twenty twenty two, I believe. Okay. Yeah, and also um saying Um uh, Well uh, well you Welcome, Welcome to, the to the Great Discovery. But you mean Great Wards? Di- Whoa! Mean the Great, mean Great Tom- What? You mean the Great Towers of Thomas? <laughs> the place is actually Great Waterton. You mean the more the Great Tower of Thomases? Oh wait, there's no Thomases now. I got rid of them. Oh, Roblox is sometimes lagging on my laptop. Like, you've got thousands of Thomas just there, lagging. Ah, uh, come on, delete. Oh, there we go. Everyone's taking over Thomas. And Thomas is on his side. And he's dead. He died. And there's Thomas. Well. He died? How did he even do that? <laughs> Oh, look at that, Thomas. What happened to that? And that's what, and that's what Mr. Brown says in the original Pennington series. What episode was that? I forgot, but it's. <laughs> a, I think it's a meme. It's a... They'll drive fast. I'll be careful though, driving fast. I sometimes oh, derail like a bend. Anyways, I made those custom 80s classic subcovers in case you're wondering. Some of them are finished and some of them are okay. not. So the first subcover is Big. As you can see. Big. That's a good film with Tom Hanks. As you can see, this is the limited edition one. This is exclusive to the Bon Bon in Newcastle. <sighs> and okay. Coming to America. Okay. It's got the new 15 certificate. Whoa, Thomas is derailed. Oh, okay. stop! Oh, phew. Now to the ones that are not fully finished. So this one, so this one's Cow Shack. Mm, not see most of these things. And top secrets. Okay. Oh, I can't see the delete button. It's not Tom. fully finished yet. Looks like a void. Oh, all about later in the void. What's your favorite time card in SpongeBob? Oh. Uh, if you uh, I don't think I want you, new Root Master. I don't know. Why? Uh, my favorite title card of SpongeBob was a few moments later. For me, I think it was a few moments later. Ah, oh, I can't get into Thomas. Someone's gonna take him away. Oh no! Get into Thomas! There we go. Uh, my favorite card SpongeBob was like a few moments later. A few moments later. <laughs> if soon after. Montage. Ugh. Oh, I better turn his light on. What? Hey! Did I just 
got rid of my Thomas. It was, it was the feast. Oh well, it goes. Ah, uh, I'm stuck. What's I'm stuck? Yeah. Uh, stuck. What's stuck? I'm stuck. Mm. Oh. I need to keep my balance. Watch me. Oh. Oh, careful you. Be careful you. Oh no! What just happened? Hold down. Die. No, top no, Roblox guy's dead. Hello everybody, welcome to the island of Sodor. Today, everybody's dead. <laughs> dead engines. Today, all the engines have died. <laughs> that means today, the engines have died after watching all engines go. <laughs> Wah! It's almost nightmare! Good evening and welcome back to Thomas Land Sodor Island. Today, all the engines have died after watching all engines go. Yeah, but Liam Fitzgerald's rant on the reboot is back. What do you mean? It was originally blocked, but then it just suddenly came back. Are you going to do a commentary on it? No, I'm not. Why? I like it. When, I, I never knew you made commentaries. Did you like my commentary on on um I am a Disney dog haters rant on air buddies? Well, kind of. But what does the Disney dog hater like? Probably nothing really. Why? Judging by her name, she hates Disney movies with dogs. What's what? What Disney movies did, what, does he like? I don't know. What about Disney movies for cats? What about Disney movies for cats? No, I do not like cats. The film. Not the no no no. I'm not talking about the cats film. Disney film for cats in it. Nearest to cats. Oh, yeah. And uh, what else? Um... Any Disney films that don't have dogs in it? I'm just going to show you my commentary. I've already seen it, but you can show it. Ugh, but, but I want to see if I, you agree with me on every single thing that she says. Wait, what's your next commentary you plan to make? I don't know. Um. Uh... this face, just... Let's just watch it and see. Air buddies, more like water bitches. Oh my god, this movie sucks super mega ultra censor? hard. Um, sorry? Why did you have to censor it? Because he said, he said she said an offensive word. 
ad mock name. That was a horrible way to describe this movie. This movie is about the five puppies, and they like to go on horrible adventures. The horrible or failure adventures term is overused now. Why are they called the group Air Buddies? Because they were born by Air Bud's mom or something. Because when was the first time? When was the, when was the first time the buddies were showing in an Air Bud movie? I don't, I don't, don't think, I don't know if, don't, I don't know if which one they were introduced in. Mm, I don't, I think they were, I think they were, but anyways. Movie. Butterball is the worst character in this Buddies franchise. Just because a character is mischievous doesn't mean you have to say is the worst character. The same goes to Devious Diesel, Norman Price, and Spud the Scarecrow. Even though I like Diesel, Norman Price, and Spud. Buddha likes to sex with Chloe from Beverly Hills Chihuahua. Dogs never sex with other dogs. Both of these characters aren't related. Mud Bud likes Did to hang out with Peppa yeah. Pig to the dirty huh? mud. Did he just said S-E-X? Mm-hmm. Think she did, but even though it said it contained sex, what the heck? Peppa Pig is never even related to Air Buddies. Sure, Mud Bud from Air Buddies, Peppa Pig, and Pestle from Big Barn Farm love being in the mud, but that's not what I wanted to hear. B Dog likes to listen to Gucci Gang by Lil Pump 24 7. B Dog loves dancing to music, not listening to songs 24 7. Rosebud is a huge crybaby. What is this? Rosebud never cries in these movies. Buddy and Molly are the stupid Buddy's parents who like to send Mr. Fuzzy Puss from Nine Lives to the Hell. Buddy and Molly are kind parents to their pups, though they never appeared again after Snow Buddies. Sniffer is so dumb and crazy. Sniffer actually helped Buddy, Molly, Noah, and Harry to find their pups. And nobody gives a f about the rest of the characters. Yeah, don't mention the other characters because it'll get even worse. It has the movies yeah, that are Snow time. Buddies, Space Buddies, San Huh? Oh, well, maybe a waste of time. Why does it say all new movie on Snow Buddies? Wait, sorry? Why does it say all new movie on Snow Buddies in the cover? Because it was new, new at the time. Because it'll get even worse. It has the movies that are Snow Buddies, Space Buddies, Santa Buddies, Spooky Buddies, Treasure Buddies, and Super Buddies, which were horrible movies. I only like the movies up to Santa Buddies because starting with Spooky Buddies... The franchise didn't get better. I can't believe I used Hi. to like this movie, but now I hate it. Franchise didn't. The Spooky oh, why, why do you why why do you think uh, that these three movies are the next three are horrible? No, not no, they're not they're not awful. They're just not as good. Okay then. Buddies, Treasure Buddies, and Super Buddies, which were horrible movies. I only like the movies up to Santa Buddies because starting with Spooky Buddies, the franchise didn't get better. I can't believe I used to like this movie, but now I hate it so much with a burning passion. Well, the first four are part of my childhood. The worst scene is when Air Buddies disrupting the screen showing 101 Dalmatians, even though I hate 101 Dalmatians. What? I love 101 Dalmatians. Why on earth do you hate this movie? Oh, wait, I don't want to bash your opinions. The characters are really dumb, the music is crazy, and the voices are terrible. Who cares about that? Who likes Air Buddies? You know what? I don't give a care about who likes it or hates it. So you screw Air Buddies, and screw care. Lady and the Tramp. You don't even like Lady and the Tramp either? Huh? Because fictional characters don't have opinions, don't they? Screw Air Buddies. Okay. Oh, I don't give a care about who likes it or hates it. So screw Air Buddies, and screw Lady and the Tramp. You don't even like Lady and the Tramp either? Oh my giddy aunt. A dog's purpose is so many times better That's than Air Disney. Buddies. Pardon? That's not Disney. I know that. It's uh, it's made by Entertainment One. End of rant. What does a dog- Well, it's Entertainment One in the UK and Universal US. Okay, then. Dog's purpose have to do with this movie, though I kind of like this movie. Next rant. Who cares about your next rant? So, guys, that was literally the worst rant ever. So, I am, I, though I think it's a good um, um, job on doing it for the first episode. But anyways, this is A. Smith's Fun Entertainment signing off.
make sure you follow me on Discord and please subscribe to me if you haven't already and turn on the notification bell. So yeah, thanks for watching this video and goodbye. Anyways, why? Anyways, why? Why did you used to not make commentaries at the time? Um, it's only until I saw um Kane and the GWR fifteen five one. One thousand five hundred class engine to a Thomas one. Anyway, Thomas and friends, more like. Wait. Oh my god, this show sucks. It's had very. Oh, wait. next girl, where'd you go? Next girl, where have you gone? Oh, my good friend, come on, just come back to the flipping stream. You know what? I think I'm just going to end the stream right there and then. So, yeah. Because I don't think I can wait for my friends to come back. Anyways. Thank you for watching this stream and uh, goodbye.